Hey guys, welcome. Today I'm going to be showing you Editor's Pick by Raquel Welch in the color Shaded Ice Latte Macchiato. Hello, hello everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So I have reviewed Editor's Pick before, but never in this color. And well, it's new, <laughs> the, these new cool tone colors. And wow, wow, wow. Every time that I think that I have found a blonde that fits me, something else comes along. And I think I found one, guys. I think I found one. I think this is a winner, winner, chicken dinner. I, I really do. I think this one is most definitely these cool tones are working so well for me. They're working really good with my skin tone <laughs> and I and even with the rooting. I'm <laughs> just so over the moon. I'm just so, so happy with them. Um, the roots don't even bother me and I, I can't even believe it. Wow, wow, wow. You know, we do grow. We do grow with our wigs. I mean, at, the more we're out there, the more we wear our wigs, the more we change up our styles and our colors. It's, oh gosh, it's so much it's fun for me. It's exciting. It gives me something to look forward to sometimes. So, with Editor's Pick, this gorgeous, gorgeous new cool tone color. We're gonna, I'm going to show you an up close of it just in a minute. I'm going to also show you some other, uh, two other blondes that I have by Raquel Welch and kind of show them up here so you can kind of get an idea of this new shade that I'm in love. I love, I love you. I love you. <laughs> so anyways, Editor's Pick has a beautiful monofilament at top temple to temple lace front she has heat friendly fibers no guys don't don't get too scared when I say the heat friendly fibers especially in these shorter ones I have my first editor's pick and she's right here I've had her for hmm, I don't know a year over a, a year now I'll being honest, I don't wear her daily. I switch her on and off, you know, every so often. Um, and this, she's still in awesome shape. And she's not long. And I know the longer heat-friendly, they do tangle a little bit faster. But I've noticed with the shorter ones that they're okay. They're, they're fine. They really are, in my opinion, anyways. But just in case you're wondering, this was my first one at Editor's Pick, and she's in the color Golden Pecan, RL1388. And you know what, guys? I remember ordering her, or getting her, and I was scared because I thought she was too blonde for me. What? Look, look at the difference. I am so in love with this blonde. Oh my gosh. And I am just a blonde girl now. And I thought this was too dark for me. Or too light. I'm sorry. Too blonde. Put it that way. I thought this was too blonde for me back in the day. A year ago. <laughs> and that's just a great example of how we can adjust and how we can uh, how we can grow with our uh, wig wearing days I'm just getting excited here but really we can we can adjust we can grow we can have fun with our wigs we really can and there's nothing more exciting for me than to change up my style and my color and the length, the shape, everything. It's its exciting for me. It's fun. It uh, takes my mind off of other things. It takes my mind off of hair loss. It takes my mind off of 
hard day of being a mommy and a wife and other things, um, it allows me to have me time. And it is okay to have those things in life. And so anyways, I'm not on here to take to give a lecture or anything. I just wanted to share my love for wigs with you all. Let's go ahead and take a peek at the inside of her cap. Shaded Ice Latte Macchiato is a contrast of sandy blonde and cool platinum highlights with a medium brown root. has a beautiful lace front. Monofilament top. A tad of permatease here, which helps with that lift, and I like that. Open left it on the sides and back. Velcro adjustable straps and felt nape and felt bendable ear tabs. Okay guys, before I do a spin, I want to show you guys her next to another blonde. So you can kind of get an, ex you know, an idea of the color again. Now this one, this style is maximum impact and she's in the color biscuit. She's not shaded, just biscuit. So if you're wondering about how she would look compared to the shaded biscuit, just envision her having a darker or a medium brown root, just the same as this one. So this is biscuit compared to her. Let me show you guys. So hopefully you could see that. Um, she's much, much lighter. She has a lot more platinum blonde going through her. This has sandy blonde and platinum blonde with a dark root. This one has a lot more platinum. And then I have Seam Stiller here. And she's in the color Pell Golden Honey, which is RL1688. And, and of course, she's going to have more of that golden honey in her. But she has some of that platinum blonde. But, you know, I guess she would look more like the Pell Golden Honey. Let me kind of, if I can do this, show you guys all three together. So that kind of gives you an idea of these blondes. And of course, neither one of these are rooted, but this one is. And the three close up together. Yeah, I'm really liking the cool tones. And every time I think, like I said, every time I think I found one, uh, a blonde color for me, someone's coming out with something else. But the cool tones seem like they're really fitting my skin tone. And especially now that it's, you know, it's cold outside. It's fall, almost winter. And, and no tan, no nothing. This is pretty. This is pretty. Let's go ahead and take a look at her all the way around now. Oh, oh, oh. 
so love these beachy waves and Raquel Welch's lace fronts. They're amazing. Guys, just look. Look. It just melts right in. It just melts right into your head. I love them. Love them, love them, love them. Yes, I'm a big fan of Raquel Welch. I really am. Her wigs and her personally. So, you can get this one from Name Brand Wigs. I have a coupon code that I can share with you all. It is Kim30. And always look in my description box what that coupon code is good for. There, there are certain brands that it's good for. So, uh, with that being said, I'm going to say bye. And I'll see you all in my next video. Thank you all so much for watching. Bye, guys.